Hi everyone, it's back to school time and I'm just gonna show you a few of my back to school favorites. Um, these will be great to help your kid throughout the school year. Uh, for our little ones, um, I know when we homeschooled, we did a lot with Aesop's Fables. These are of course wonderful stories that um, teach children life lessons. Um, Aesop's Stories for Little Children is exactly that. It is a younger version of our Aesop's Fables. Um, great, beautiful illustrations, small amounts of text on each page. And um, these are just gorgeous. So this one has uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine stories within this book. So this is Little Children, for Little Children. And then we have our illustrated stories from Aesop. And uh, this is just one that you'll want to keep on the side of your bed and to read at bedtime. Um, it's got a beautiful ribbon bookmark and it categorizes them by greed, pay, wait, greed, quarrels, pride, trickery, and oh, friendships, cunning, retorts, comeuppance. So then we go through these stories. This one has, of course, more text, but it's still illustrated. So there's great pictures every few pages um, to keep your children interested. This is great for your um, your independent readers. Okay, now September is Classical Music Month, but you know, every month is great for classical music. Uh, we have a brand new book, it's called First Book About the Orchestra, and this is really fun. Um, it's got buttons, oops, I forgot, to, I need to turn it on, okay. Turn it on, and it plays beautiful music, okay? And each page talks about the different um, aspects of an orchestra and on every page there are not almost every page there's something to push and you can actually interrupt and start the next one so I love this one we learned a lot about the orchestra last year in school and so we we're excited to see that now at the very end there's a QR code and you can um, use your phone, click on that, and you can watch the whole orchestra play the whole piece of music together. It's beautiful. Um, garden Sounds is the same concept, uh, and again, with the little buttons that you push on each page, and this is just a gorgeous little book about uh, the different sounds in a garden. We've got rain falling and grasshoppers. This is beautiful. Look at the illustrations on that. That is just gorgeous. Um, okay, so classical music. Uh, again, uh, this is a reference book. This one has QR codes at the bottom as well, which is wonderful because on every single page you can click on the uh, QR code and this will um, tell you more about the page that you're reading. And this one has, there's a timeline, yes, there's a timeline in the back, which is very helpful. Okay, speaking of timelines, we have our new timelines of world history. Now, I know a lot of homeschoolers um, study timelines all year long, and so this is a fantastic um, accompaniment to your homeschool curriculum. Okay, so this is uh, from the Stone Age to the Millennium. All right, and here it tells you how to use the book and how it's divided up. Okay, this is the ancient world. Beautiful photographs and illustrations, the Middle Ages. Let's see. Okay. And then in the back, you know, it's got a index in the back. And internet links got all the kings and queens, prime ministers and presidents. So that's a wonderful timeline book for your homeschool group. Okay, our Look Inside books are wonderful. So this one is Look Inside Our World, and this is a lift the flap book. So there's tons of flaps for them to lift and see underneath. Kids love that. So this is about running rivers. This is about fascinating forests. Now I'm gonna say that, oh, this is watery world and this flips off. 
upside down and then there's more flaps. This is amazing. Just gorgeous. Love this. Okay, so this would be for your ages probably four to seven. Um, we have a peek inside series, which is for our littler ones, and then our see inside, which is for a bit older. Okay, so, oh, not your everyday illustrated thesaurus. This is so fun. This should just be a staple on your child's uh, desk at home or at school. And so it's just so much fun. It's illustrated, and so it makes it um, beautiful to look at. And we've got um, animal words, types of animals, and then all kinds of words to help them write creatively. And this is just so much fun. Now this one is $12.99, and it's in a flexible binding, so it's nice and sturdy. Um, this is just a fun one that I thought I would throw in there, and that's origami. Now, um, at our school, I know that the international studies were learning how to do some origami. They were teaching the kids a few things. And so what you can do with this is you open this front page up, and it tells you all the different types of origami that you can make. So there's the swan, a fox, a butterfly, a sailboat and a frog and then the beautiful colored pages inside you can make any of those designs with them so this is just super fun Let's see if I'm forgetting anything for right now I think that's all I wanted to show you but um, if you have any questions please let me know thanks